So I ended up going to the Adidas employee store two different times last week and I wanted to show you guys some of my pickups from those trips. What is going on guys, Hess here, CollectiveKicks.com and I wanted to bring you guys a video today to show you guys the Adidas pickups that I ended up getting recently. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram or Twitter, I was tweeting out and posting some IG stories of my trips to Adidas employee store and I showed you guys some of the stuff in those stories, basically like what they had in stock. But I didn't show you guys what I picked up, so I'm gonna show you guys that in this video. First trip, I ended up getting this pair right here for actually only $20, which is pretty crazy. Uh, but I ended up, so I ended up getting these for $20 because I had to return the uh, NMDs that I ended up getting the last time for the wife. She really didn't like the white and the pink colorway. And I tried to see if a couple of my girlfriends that I know wanted them, but they didn't really want them either. They're just too white for them. So I ended up returning them and then they were gonna give me store credit. I'm like, man, let me just go grab these real quick. So I went back to the racks and I grabbed a pair of multicolor. This is the DPR Limited Pure Boost and I don't really know much about the DPR version. Uh, I definitely saw that they released another version of the Pure Boost, but I didn't really pique my interest because I liked the other version. However, this version does have a normal tongue, but that was one of my complaints from the version that they dropped earlier this year was it had that weird burrito tongue. So I will have a detailed review of these, a comparison to the Pure Boost and really like a follow-up after like three months or so in the Pure Boost and uh, expect that video to be happening soon, but I need to break these in and wear these a bit uh, before I do that video. But this is a nice multicolor look. It kind of reminds me of the Nike multicolor more of than the Adidas multicolors, historically speaking. Definitely kind of has that um, flying it racer sort of vibe to it, but definitely dope and I really like this overall colorway. So I was glad to get these, especially for 20 bucks. You couldn't really go wrong. And the box price, box price on these are $170. So. Uh, pretty cool that I was able to get them for so cheap, but that was my first pickup that I ended up getting. And then I went back to the Adidas employee store, but shout out to Jen who actually came to Portland the other weekend and she filmed my Saucony collab. And we basically went around and she shot pictures for uh, Saucony to display those pictures on Saucony's website and whatnot. So I'll have some of those pictures and stuff and a little bit more on the Saucony collab coming up. So stay tuned if you guys wanna see more of those videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button and I'll let you guys know when I post um, videos in the future. But I ended up getting the wife this little shirt right here. It says Portland, as you can see, with a little bit of roses on it. Um, and uh, yeah, I don't know, nice little print shirt. So I thought she'd like that one. That was a success. She liked that t-shirt and then, See here, got a bunch of just randomness here. I got some stretchy pants. N nice little uh, bend of the knee ventilation right here. I, don't, I mean, these are the wives, obviously. I just like buying her stretchy pants. These ones retail at 110. Man, thumbs up to, to girls in stretchy pants. I don't know, there's something about it, right? Uh, but I ended up getting those. I thought she would like those. And she has a couple more Adidas now than Nikes. Um, it's nice for her to obviously be able to mix up uh, these as well when she rocks her Adidas. And then I ended up getting just a plain logo tee. I'm, honestly, I'm pretty sure I already have this shirt, but I was like, I might as well just get another one if I didn't have it. So there's just the Adidas logo tee on there. And actually I was trying to get the Adidas logo tee in this print, but they didn't actually have it. Uh, this um, hoodie was super sick though. And, uh, and you could see like it has a camo in the hoodie part. And then it also has the camo on the print of the Adidas logo right here. But this was a pretty nice uh, hoodie too. I don't remember the price of it, but um, but I'll try to link it to Adidas website if you guys are curious. If you guys are interested in shopping in Adidas US on their sales section, it's an extra 30% off right now for back to school. And there's a code in the description if you guys wanna go over there and shop. They have some really solid deals on sneakers, but they also have really, really good deals on apparel. I found some Raining Champ stuff on there that's like super duper cheap, like a third the price of retail. So definitely some good deals if you're trying to get some more apparel for the like those boost shoes that you may or may not have. So I definitely recommend you go in and check it out and see what they have. The last thing I ended up getting was a pair of sneakers and I was so stoked that they had these, man. So I've been waiting to try these. I've been just wanting to get them for half price. Uh, I didn't. I knew eventually it was gonna happen. I didn't wanna have to pay full retail, but I ended up getting the Aniki uh, runners here and this is a shoe that you guys have been asking me to review for quite a while now And it's one that I just have been waiting to get my hands on a decent colorway They've had so many different wild and crazy colorways. I wasn't really feeling it this black one with the, the white stripes Boost midsole and then the gum uh, bottom. 
I just was like, this is the one that I would get, and this is the one that I would rock because this is like such a great colorway, in my opinion. Um, and uh, retail on these, I don't remember. I think these were 120. Man, I'm so bad. So the retail on the hoodie was only 55 bucks, and I got it for half price. And the retail on these Iniki boots are 120, so I got these for 60 bucks. So for 60 dollars, definitely probably one of the best sneaker steals that I've had in recent times because this is just such a great price point for this shoe. However, I definitely need to do a detailed review of these uh, because you guys have been asking for it and I've been definitely curious about these since they've dropped because you guys already know like the Pure Boost, uh, first Pure Boost, not these ones, but the original ones, this kind of has that sort of vibe to them, at least aesthetically and uh, kind of boost wise. So I, I'm just wanting to know if this is good like the old Pure Boost or like what type of boost is this shoe right here. So. Uh, for the cheap price point of 120, I'm definitely really excited to give it a try. But that is the main pickup that I ended up getting. Uh, 60 and then eight, um, 20 is 80 bucks. So 80 bucks for two pairs of sneakers. I mean, that's pretty much awesome in my opinion. But that's what I ended up getting from the Adidas employee store. Had a lot of fun going there. Shout out to my homie that always hooks me up with passes to get into the Adidas employee store. Much appreciated. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and I have more videos coming. So if you guys missed my previous video, I did a Nike outlet video as well. I didn't do a top five Tuesday video this week. I honestly just didn't have time to, but I will come back strong next Tuesday for another top five Tuesday sneaker related video. Excited to bring you guys more content coming up. I have another unboxing and double up of another shoe that I will be getting here soon uh, as well. So I'm really excited for that. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys are still enjoying the content. If you guys have suggestions for future content, of course, leave a comment in the comment section. I always love to see new comments from new people, and I always definitely appreciate it when you guys hit the thumbs up button. Uh, virtual high fives for you guys. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and we will catch you for some more videos soon. Peace.